Well, the hearing lasted all day and just wrapped up a few minutes ago. Now, today in court, Josh Duggar's attorney argued that Duggar's statements to special agents should be tossed out since Duggar, at the time, requested to talk with his attorney. But today, the judge ruled that Duggar was never actually in custody at the time when he spoke to agents and that he could have remained silent and could have walked away at any time. Mr. Duggar, what would you like to say anything today? Excuse us. Josh Duggar and his attorneys were back in federal court in Fayetteville. Most of Monday's testimony centered around statements made to federal agents as they executed a search warrant at Duggar's car lot back in November 2019. According to court testimony, agents seized cell phones and computers from Duggar. One Homeland Security agent testified that child pornography was found on a desktop computer inside the business. The government revealed that forensic analysis showed it was downloaded in May 2019. According to court testimony, when special agents talked to Duggar, he said he wanted to speak with his attorney, but he still spoke to agents. In court, the main statement defense attorneys took issue with was when Duggar asked agents, quote, why are you here with someone downloading child porn? End quote. The judge ruled Duggar was not in custody at the time and could have refused to answer questions, but chose to answer some of them anyway. Duggar was eventually arrested in April this year and is charged with receipt of and possessing child pornography. And today in court, defense attorneys also claimed that the government failed to preserve some evidence that could potentially prove Duggar innocent. The judge did not agree and ruled against the defense's motion. Live in Fayetteville, Brett Raines, 4029 News.